Hey, I'm Chris Clark. Uh, I'm a user of Colostrum and uh, just wanted to do a little video uh, to talk a little bit about, uh, I guess, a little bit of an experiment that I did with a couple of different Colostrum products. Um, I recently walked into TBR Labs and here's my receipt. Went in and um, purchased a bottle of the Colostrum product. You can see for $29.95, which was actually cheaper from them direct than it was for me to go to the health food stores around. Actually went around looking in the health food stores looking for it and couldn't get a hold of it. So I begged them and they, they basically said, sure, I'll give it to you for cheaper than them anyway. Um, now, when it comes to the quality of the product, I decided that I wanted to test it um, and look at it. I know that when it comes to colostrum, the flavor should have a slightly dairy flavor to it. It should be natural. It shouldn't taste synthetic in any way. Um, and it should look a certain way. It should have a, a yellow tint. And So I thought that I would do a little bit of testing with this stuff that I bought and uh, the Immune Tree Colostrum 6 that we have over here. So I'm going to do this again. I've already did this and I did this for my own purposes as a user of Colostrum. I wanted to just see for myself and taste and touch. And I want to do the same experiment that we did before right now in front of you. So if you take a look here, here's our piece of paper. I'm going to open up this colostrum. And if you see here, I don't know if I can get it to come off, but if we can get this sticker to peel off, they just covered it with, uh, with a gluten-free sticker. If you know anything about colostrum, gluten doesn't have anything to do with colostrum. No colostrum product should have gluten in it. But they covered up the seal so that's the Immune Tree certified Dr. Anthony Kleinsmith colostrum. As you can see, ours uh, is the Immune Tree colostrum, the real stuff. Um, so let's go ahead and do a quick test. I'm going to open this up if I can. <laughs> Sorry. Okay, so here we have some of the capsules. You see them here. I'm gonna open up the other colostrum. Put it in my hand. We'll take a look. Now I don't know how well you can see on the cat the camera, but you can see that these ones have a slightly more yellow tint. They're darker. Now let's go ahead and open up a couple of them. Okay, so you can see the texture. Okay, here's the other one that came out of this bottle. Now, I don't know how well you can see on the camera, but there's definitely a much more yellow tint on this side. Now, if you look at the textures, this is gonna clump a lot more you look at this, it's more of a fine powder. It doesn't clump up so much. Now, this is the challenge that I want to send forth to everybody out there who uses this stuff. Don't take it from me. Don't take it from anybody else. Do this test, and the most important thing is the taste test. Like I said before, if you know anything about colostrum, the flavor of it should have a slightly dairy flavor to it. It's a dairy product. It comes out of a cow. Should taste something like milk, at least in my opinion. Um, let's go ahead and I'll taste it right now. Now I have no way of proving to you that what I'm tasting is what I'm saying. So that's why I'm challenging you to do the same thing. We'll send you a free bottle. We'll send you some stuff so you can test this. So first off, I'm going to taste ours. Now, as I let it dissolve, I push it up against the top of my mouth. Dissolves smooth, and again, in the best way possible, the way that I think of it, it's almost like a cheese powder, but not gross. Don't think gross. Um, I'm not gonna say colostrum is the best tasting stuff in the world, but it has a dairy quality. I know that came from an animal, and I know that that's natural. Now, when I taste the other stuff, as you can see, again, it doesn't clump, doesn't stick to my fingers. 
have to really get to it. Now, the first texture, first off, you're, you're feeling the graininess. It shouldn't be grainy. And the flavor that comes through for me, and the way that I've described it to people, it's almost like when I was a kid when I chewed up a piece of paper and it tasted like a spit wad. It almost tasted like it came from paper. Um, so other people have said maybe like flour. And again, I'm not the only person that has done this test. We've, I've done this test over the phone with a few people and they're saying the same thing. It tastes synthetic. It doesn't taste natural. It tastes like there's something else in there. It doesn't taste milky. It doesn't taste like it came from an, an animal. Um, so for me, that for me, seeing is believing, tasting is believing, and uh, you know that's uh, that's where we're coming from. The immune tree colostrum six is uh, again the same formulation that Dr. Anthony Kleinsmith's been using for years. It's been certified. There's all the paperwork in the world for it. Take a look. Thanks a lot.